Good Saturday morning, guys. Um, welcome back. Glad to see you guys again. Thanks for watching. Uh, or thanks for tuning in, I should say. Uh, today, I'm going to be back on a chicken coop build, chicken run build. Um, you know, uh, I know it's been a little bit just busy. Um, so I'm going to show you real quick what we're going to be doing today. Uh, and I'll probably end up just putting the camera in time lapse again. Uh, but I'll stop and let you know um, when I, uh, you know, get on to the next step. So I know it's a little hard to see, but I've got some extra wire from probably when I built that one. Uh, but I'm going to be putting this on the bottom of this chicken run, the new one, running at a, you know, probably a couple feet out. <clears throat> um, so obviously, you know, I'll end up cutting this wire. I'm just going to go ahead and do that all the way around on this on this side here. Uh, I need to get that done because there's a little pile of dirt right there, you know, right here that I'm going to use to fill that in. I'm not going to worry about putting, you know, any wood or anything, but, you know, just because that area is, <clears throat> uh, the, the soil is lower. And then inside I have, uh, some hardwood mulch. I wished, I wished I could find, uh, I mean, I, I know I could have gone to get some, uh, triple shred, but triple shred usually pretty expensive. Um, so I just went to Walmart and I just got regular shredded, uh, hardwood because, you know, I mean, it was the quickest, easiest place, uh, in town for me to get it. And that'll be going, uh, inside here. Um, so eventually, you know, the chickens will be on it. They can scratch through it and also to help keep mud down it'll uh decompose eventually and then um you know if i ever need to i'll add more and it also keep me from you know having to walk through mud because half the run won't have that cover on it at least right now so anyways without further ado uh i will get you guys on uh time lapse i guess and i'll get started and we'll see you at the end all right, guys. Uh, little problem. My camera froze. I don't know if I got that last part. Uh, I just I don't know. Um, then I figured out. I believe I was doing time lapse in photo mode. So <laughs> I don't know how that's gonna work out, but I'll make something work. Uh, I'll just show you guys real quick what I got, and then I'll move on to the next step. I have I know it's a little hard to see it. I'll walk around and show you guys real quick. We got over to here. This is where we ran out. Right here. Because I don't have too much to do. I probably got something laying around somewhere. So anyways, uh, we're going to go ahead and get this pile of dirt moved. And we're going to get that put over here. Because again, as I said, you can see the gap underneath that rail. So that's where I really need the dirt for now, especially. So anyways, without further ado, uh, let's get this dirt moved. This is what I got. Yeah, I got all the soil. Not all the way around, just on this, this high area. Um, so... I'm going to go ahead and put it on the correct time lapse this time. And I got to get the wire on this thing. Um, so, be back with you guys.
All right, guys. Uh, I got most of it done. As you can see, with one person, it was a little bit of a pain in the butt. I'd have been probably done by now if I had help. Uh, I, I mean, I'm not saying that I absolutely don't have somebody to help me, but, uh, you know, I don't know. I just choose to do things by myself, that's all. Um, anyways, uh, you can't really see it too well, the netting, but, you know, I got the three sides done. I just have this, this side left to do. Uh, but I think for right now, I'm going to go ahead and... Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, maybe grab something to eat, get something to drink, and I'll probably finish up the wire, and then uh, I'll probably record again when I do the next steps. Um, I need to uh, I gotta, I, I need to put the mulch in there, and then I'm also um, I'm going to seed this area. Uh, lots of rye to try to get it to come up real quick. Uh, before I move the chickens over so hopefully they don't you know tear up the, the stuff but I really need to get them moved over so you know I, th I think I can wait a little bit longer all right well I'll see you guys in a little bit all right guys I'm back uh just doing a little bit of work off camera I'll show you in a second uh moving on to the next uh phase we're going to put the mulch in the chicken run here. Um, I did get the uh, wire on this side. Doors cut open. Got that all done. As you can see. There's a tarp that goes on top. I'll get that probably towards the end. I did start here. Uh, if you can see, you know, wire, the wire... Um, because the zip ties eventually will end up breaking, so. And yes, I know somebody is going to have a fit about the zip ties sticking out. I got to finish tr trimming them. But anyways, without further ado, uh, I'll get started on these next few steps. All right, guys. Well, that's all I'm going to get done for today. Um, I uh, did a little extra off camera. Uh, I'll show you real quick. We also got a storm coming in, it looks like. Uh, it's pretty windy out here, too. But uh, we're, we're making way. So I got some... I had a bale of straw laying around. Uh, it's always important put something over the grass seed. I'll have to get another bale, I guess, to do that back there. Uh, but otherwise, um, it's coming along, and, you know, I really can't wait 
see the grass come up can't wait to get the chickens there in their new run you know uh, and eventually get the chicken coop built back here so that'll be exciting but anyways uh, So, I'm going to get inside and get a shower before uh, this storm does get in. Uh, i got to go. i got some other things to do. So anyways, uh, I want to thank you guys for watching. Um, and, and thank you for... But anyways, I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, please stay tuned for more on the chicken coop build lawn care videos should be coming soon so hit that subscribe button down below hit the thumbs up and we'll see you on the next one peace